Hello viewers, how are you? In today's video, we are going to discuss what is uh, NRD 90 M test keys and uh, why it is appearing as the build number on your Huawei devices. Viewers, NRD 90 M test keys is not itself a big issue. It is actually the code name of Android Nugget. So, in all devices, you will find this thing. In uh, Samsung devices which are running Android Nugget, you can find uh, NRD 90M test keys. In Motorola devices, you can find uh, in the software information, you will find this. So, why in Huawei devices it is not showing uh, the correct build number and uh, instead it is showing uh, NRD 90M test keys? There are two major reasons. The first, uh, the first reason is uh, that. Uh, users are installing wrong version of firmware on their devices like if uh, your device is from middle east and uh, the middle eastern devices have a c185 cust, cust version and you are installing the european uh, firmware on this device so it is not going to work so it will eventually fail and if you have purchased device from operator and you have contract with that operator so this device device will be locked uh, to that uh, <coughs> operator and the build number might be different. So you have to actually find the correct firmware for your device which matches your cust version like if you are if you are using C636 uh, version uh, of device. So you must install C636 version of firmware. The second re reason. Second reason of uh, this problem is the installation method we all know that uh, from the beginning we used to install the firmwares uh, by extracting the uh, zip file and putting the update.app uh, file in the deload folder and then we process the installation till marshmallow this uh, method was applicable but after the nugget upgrade Huawei has separated the firmware and the OEM applications like uh, now when you download the firmware you will find two files in that uh, uh, folder one will be update.zip and second will be full data like uh, uh, Huawei then then will be your regional code if you are using device from uh, operator the operator name will be added to that uh, zip file that's that second file which is also called full data normally we call it full data so this second device contains your all applications, your updated application if missing from settings, the, that file is missing because you have only installed update.zip which, which is the actually only stock firmware of Android Nugget. But you have not installed the second file which contains all OEM applications. So if you want to install those applications or you want to install the second part, to get that uh, to get those applications back in your phone then you need to flash the second file the best way to flash the second file is through TWRP recovery because some uh, users uh, extract the second file and uh, uh, put the update file update update .app file in deload folder and uh, just uh, run the upgrade it will be successful you will see the build number correct but problem is your applications will be missing so to install those applications you need to flash them, flash that file through TWRP recovery. Another reason which is a part of uh, this uh, you can say the installation. The second reason uh, or you can say another reason, third reason you can say. Third reason is uh, unlock bootloader. If you have received the official OTA up update notification and you have downloaded it and you try to install it but it failed. The main reason behind this failure is uh, the uh, un your unlocked bootloader. If your bootloader is unlocked, your first while, uh, file will be installed successfully. But when you when the setup will try to install the second file, it will check your device for encryption. That if your bootloader is locked or not locked, it is official or not official. Because when you lock unlock your bootloader, your device becomes customized. That is why you see the warning on startup that this device has been unlocked, blah blah blah. There is a lengthy message. So if you are going to install this Android Nugget through official OTA upgrade, then you must have a locked bootloader. And if you have unlocked bootloader, then you must use TWRP method that is the safest method uh, to upgrade to Android Nugget and if you have Android, if you have lock bootloader 
and uh, you don't receive uh, the nugget upgrade and you want to install manually then you have to keep in mind that you that you use a method that, that you use the correct version of uh, firmware if you install wrong firmware and even though you install the second file of wrong firmware you will never get the correct build number it will be nrd 90 m test keys so viewers there are three main reasons one is wrong firmware second thing is unlock bootloader and uh, third thing is uh, the wrong installation method so you need to follow the correct method whichever uh, is suitable for you there are many methods on the internet you can use any of them i have uh, fixed a lot of phones uh, of uh, users who, those who contacted me through whatsapp or live chat i have been uh, in the beginning it was the installation was not an issue but after the nugget upgrade it has been uh, more complicated actually it is not complicated but uh, users don't have uh, much information about uh, the installation process so i have tried to explain that what is an nrd 90 m test keys and how you can avoid and what is the best way to fix this the best way to fix this issue is uh, flashing the correct data file of your uh, firmware version only this way you can fix your problem and you can fix your build number Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more information. Thank you.